Welcome back to you know. Metal G, or Betelgeuse it's a red giant star if you put it where the sun is it would extend out to the orbit of Jupiter it's enormous it's very unstable it's about to explode exploring the complexities of the universe reveals events of immense magnitude. Such as the feared spectacle of an enormous starburst these occurrences have the potential to reverberate through everything we observe. And even those hidden from our sight amidst this cosmic drama Betelgeuse a red supergiant star stands out. Dwarfing our sun by a staggering 764 times catching the attention of astrophysicists like Brian Cox. Betelgeuse residing on the eastern shoulder of the Orion constellation has long fascinated sky gazes due to its brilliance named. After the giant shoulder it is the second largest star in Orion emanating a distinctive red hue this unusual coloration. Traditionally perceived as a sign of trouble has intrigued scientists for centuries initially studied by Greek scientist Timmy who could only discern. Its orange color modern-day astronomers have delved deeper into Betelgeuse's peculiarities notably its variable nature. Characterized by fluctuations in brightness with an apparent magnitude of 0.6 has long been recognized however recent. Observations in 2019 unveiled a new enigma as Betelgeuse exhibited unprecedented dimming causing it to shine at a magnitude of approximately 16. This alarming behavior prompted a closer investigation leading scientists to propose a startling hypothesis. Betelgeuse could go superb and of imminently Brian Cox, a respected particle physicist, and science communicator echoed this concern likening Betelgeuse to a ticking time bomb. the James Webb Space Telescope's imagery further reinforced these apprehensions the mystery deepens as scientists grapple with understanding when Betelgeuse might explode its massive size around 15 times that of the sun places it in a supernova category yet the exact timing remains elusive. Advanced tools including the James Webb Space Telescope and the Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory have been employed to monitor Betelgeuse activities closely. Recent findings suggest that Betelgeuse's behavior deviates from its historical patterns the star known for dimming every 400 and 30 days now undergoes these fluctuations twice as rapidly a specific incident in February 2021 marked a significant dimming event raising concerns among scientists about the star's unpredictable nature in conclusion the enigmatic. Science exhibited by Betelgeuse continue to perplex astronomers intensifying the speculation about its potential. Supernova event The scientific community remains vigilant utilizing cutting-edge technology to unravel the mysteries. Surrounding this celestial giant the onset of Betelgeuse's perplexing behavior widely known as the Great Dimming triggered widespread concern and speculation about the potential for the star's imminent explosion this dimming phenomenon with a range of 1-2 between. 2019 and 2020 reached its lowest recorded level in 2019 prompting experts to initially project a supernova event within the next 100,000 years however the scientific community experienced a paradigm shift when Betelgeuse unexpectedly brightened after the great demi-astrophysicist Andrea Dupre from the Harvard Smithsonian Center for Astrophysics noted that the star is now 150% brighter than its usual luminosity elevating it to the seventh brightest star in the night sky despite initial concerns. Betelgeuse resurgence introduced a new layer of complexity to its behavior this resurgence accompanied by distinctive red glow. In the southern hemisphere of the sky spurred various theories regarding the root cause of the great dimming notably the red glow, is a characteristic feature of red supergiant stars signifying the final stage in a star's life Betelgeuse's surface temperature of approximately 3500 Kelvin cooler than the sun's 5500 Kelvin contributes to its unique red hue emitting. Less energy per unit of surface area Ryan Cox's query about whether Betelgeuse is on the brink of a supernova is nuanced by the fact that the star status as a red supergiant already signals its advanced life stage dying stars typically undergo a dimming process a phenomenon. Acknowledged by scientists however recent erratic behavior has heightened concerns prompting extensive observations by numerous Telescopes divergent perspectives exist within the scientific community regarding Betel. Juice's supernova potential The Hubble Space Telescope, a pivotal tool in this investigation unveiled a surprising revelation it indicated that the great dimming resulted from the ejection of a substantial amount of hot matter from Betelgeuse's surface creating a dust cloud that obstructed the star's light giving the appearance of fading conversely observations from the Lilla Observatory and Chile proposed an alternative explanation, they suggested a drop of 170 Kelvin in the star's surface. Temperature during the great dimming attributing it to the presence of a large temporary dark spot. On Betelgeuse a comprehensive analysis incorporating data from a telescope in Chile revealed that both the dark spot and the dust cloud played significant roles in the great dimming a dark spot. 
formed in the southern hemisphere of the star causing a localized temperature drop simultaneously the star expelled a bubble of hot gas, contributing to the overall dimming event these diverse. Interpretations underscore the complexity of Betelgeuse's behavior with scientists leaning towards the supernova hypothesis, while acknowledging alternative explanations the ongoing use of cutting-edge tools aims to unravel the ongoing enigma surrounding. Betelgeuse ensuring a vigilant watch on the captivating events unfolding in our cosmic neighborhood the James Webb Space Telescope has emerged as a pivotal tool in unraveling the mystery surrounding Betelgeuse potential super-over events. Currently it stands as the most powerful space telescope globally offering a promising avenue for scientists to glean valuable insights into the behavior of Betelgeuse the telescope's capability to study the universe's infrared bands passes that of any other holding the key to understanding the fluctuations in Betelgeuse's brightness with changing seasons as scientists leverage the James Webb Space Telescope to scrutinize Betelgeuse they aim to delve deeper into the nature of red supergiants and their impending explosive fate this focus study promises to enhance our comprehension of stellar life cycles, and their broader impact on the universe the telescope's ability to capture clearer images and conduct spectral studies of beetle. Juice's surface dust and gas clouds contribute significantly to refining models and predictions related to the star in conjunction with a James Webb Space Telescope the Atacama Large Millimeters of Millimeter Array ALMA in Chile has proven to be in. Invaluable resource ALMA's high-resolution images of Betelgeuse structure and behavior have left scientists astounded notably it captured a rare spectacle, a massive cloud of gas rising from the star's surface attributed to the pulsing caused by convection wherein hot air ascends while cooler. Gases descend DET detailed observations also unveiled the presence of dark spots on Betelgeuse's surface particularly in regions with elevated magnetic fields. These magnetic features responsible for the dark spots create loops that trap gases. Due to the star's strong magnetic field these dark spots covering approximately 20% of Betelgeuse's surface, and significantly larger than Earth contribute to the star's variable brightness. While the cause of the great dimming remains a subject of debate the heightened scrutiny from advanced telescopes raises concerns about Betelgeuse potential supernova a supernova event characterized by the death throes of A. Massive star-like Betelgeuse is inherently powerful and hazardous the explosion could release high-energy radiation far surpassing that of the sun posing a danger to nearby celestial bodies supernovas are known to emit X-rays and blast waves with fast particles capable of wreaking havoc on planets and potentially extinguishing life. Despite the dangers posed by supernova scientists currently believe that that Betelgeuse situated 640 light years away poses no immediate threat to Earth the Required distance for potential harm from a supernova is estimated to be around 160 light years however. Beyond the immediate planetary risks associated with supernovas scientists have identified a new threat these explosive events can lead to the production of heavy elements, and in some cases trigger the formation of black holes adding another layer of complexity to the far-reaching consequences of stellar explosions, the ongoing monitoring and Analysis of Betelgeuse with cutting-edge tools remain essential for advancing our understanding of these celestial phenomena, and preparing for potential cosmic challenges the potential danger discussed earlier may not be mitigated by distance especially when it comes to stars with rings nearing the end of their lives upon their explosive demise these stars send out shock waves that could impact nearby disks causing them to become extremely hot subsequently these disks emit a significant Amount of X-ray energy capable of cutting cutting the ozone layer in half within a radius of 150 light years. This environmental impact could persist for months or even years posing risks to any planet caught in the aftermath astronomers. And experts are diligently monitoring Earth's surroundings in space to ensure its safety in this pursuit. They have established a supernova warning system, called SNOOS with the upcoming SNOOS supernova relying on present neutrino detectors for future use. Despite the potential danger scientists, are enthusiastic about the unique opportunity presented by Betelgeuse current state the safety concerns have been addressed allowing scientists to gain valuable insights into the last stages of a red super giant star particularly through the upcoming Betelgeuse. Supernova this event marks a significant milestone for scientists offering an unprecedented chance to study the behavior of a red super giant before its explosion Dr. Sarah Webb from Australia Swinburne University of Technology expresses excitement over this depth of study emphasizing that scientists have never had this opportunity before while keeping a close eye on Betelgeuse provides valuable information about red supergiants. Scientists agree that the impending supernova event 
will undoubtedly leave a lasting impact on Earth. Various signs may be observed for a week or more including the star becoming exceptionally bright and visible during both day and night some. Speculate that such events may have occurred on Earth in the past with historical references suggesting instances of a second sun. In the sky in addition to the visible signs the burst of neutrinos on Earth would be another indicator of the supernova event. While these particles are harmless to humans, they can be detected by close telescopes. Some researchers argue that Betelgeuse's relatively short lifespan of 14 million years, compared to Earth's 454 billion years coupled with its rapid growth. An old age suggests a heightened risk of a supernova despite these indicators uncertainties persist and Silvato Vitala Physics. Professor at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology points out that the light waves picked up from Betelgeuse might not necessarily be originating from the star. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.